What's up guys, this is Dr. Cloud here, welcome back to the next episode of the Pokemon Omega Red Nuzlocke. And in the last episode we got thrown into this random island mishap that I don't care about at all. So, if you missed that, then check out the last episode playlist link in the description down below along with my Twitter if you want to follow along with new episodes that come out. But for today, I'm going to be essentially just rushing through this island and not really caring about what they have to say, because I just want to move on with the actual game. So, if you want to see me just kind of be annoyed right now, hit that like button. You'll enjoy it. Because I have no idea where to go anyways, so... Um... I think... I think you're supposed to, like, start on, like, Island 2 or something. Um, I'm also not worried about encounters here at all either because I have plenty of things in my boxes. I was picking up the last view in the official game because it's uh, the right thing to do there and just finish out. I really do not know where I'm going in this. He's a mushroom guy who reteaches your mom's moves. Hmm, okay. You need waterfall for that, which I do not have. It's fine, I'm not even going to worry about it. I was really trying to avoid encounters, but it's not a big deal. Uh, I will not teach anyone cut, so I hope that's not a mandatory thing to get through. I do not do not pay attention to trial and amount, mod 1. Okay. Is there... A reason this is happening. It looks like they're just ran by a motorcycle gang, I guess. Great. Can I like fight them or like Is this the boss then? No. Oh, so you have to use this at the moment. Cernius new Beltal? What is happening on these islands? I can't even remember the last time I've actually played through these islands in the normal games. So, like I said, uh, I guess bear with me in the last episode, I think I said it. I thought you were supposed to, like, get some guy's daughter or something, but, like, what is even happening in this right now? This is just really dumb, and I really do not want to play through these islands. Oh, there's another space hole. Oh, I know there's an item down here. That's not really the item I was expecting. I kind of expected something slightly better. Okay, uh, I want to get past these guys without fighting them. Okay, that's kind of dumb. I don't really want to take that chance. <sighs> I so don't want to be fighting these guys right now. Oh, yay. 
I cannot stay in on that. She's got no guard too. Dang it. Something I could move. They want to counter me. Cario. I still can't use Charlie. I just don't. Holy crap. And you have heal pulse? Are you kidding me? I'm way too weird. He has some random priority move. Yep. I called it there. That definitely would have killed Venusaur. You wouldn't go for heal pulse again, which is kind of interesting. And now I gotta take the time to heal pretty much everyone, thanks to butthole karate guys over here. I am just fuming about having to go to these dumb islands. I'm so curious what exactly I'm supposed to, like, achieve here. Is this like an actual spa or like is this like an area or something? Like you're all blocking the ways for me to get in. Okay, so there's Rock Smash. Which I mean, it's great and all, but like what am I supposed to be like achieving here in these islands? Okay, I got a syndical. Still not really answering my questions on what in the world I'm supposed to be achieving. I um, actually might have to like look up a tutorial here in the middle of this Mount Ember. That's where you get the mold trace. Oh no! So is the whole point of this just to get here to Mount Ember? I don't care about Mount Ember. Man. Uh, I really don't want to start like just losing Mon left and right because I don't know where I'm going. And I can't even fly at the moment since I have no one who can learn it. Pretty much made it through this entire way without battling anyone, so I'm betting I'm gonna hit pretty much everyone on the way back. Yep. I'm just so not feeling this island right now. I thought that said Hyper Beam again, and I was gonna blow up on this dumb, stupid lion. That's the Kindle Road. <sighs> Come on. Is that Sabrina? That is not the sprite that is sitting there. I do not know why I use that on the Totodile. But that is still not the sprite that is standing right there. Unless he has a hurricane, then I think I'm still good. Okay. 
Yeah, that is not the same sprite. That is a clearly different person. Beach trainer, my butt. Oh, I guess the PC's up and running now? Did I actually do something? I don't think I did. You know what's crazy is? I don't even have another electric... Well, I have one other electric type, but like... Who's gonna help me the most? Maybe Snorlax, actually. Strong normal type's never a bad thing. I'll take Beldum. Steel Psychic? Yeah, sure. Take the Beldum. <sighs> Still feel bad putting him in the box like that. So. Okay, so is that it? Am I done? Can I go home? Nope. Apparently, I'm just going out for a stroll. I swore it healed. I just have... Maybe I'm supposed to fight the bike trainers now? I don't know, man. I'm just trying things now. Like, I don't... What am I supposed to do? They're like, who's gonna make me? I thought I'm supposed to, like, battle them or something. Are there people in here supposed to... Okay, I got a mudkip now. Man, there's just nothing being solved right now. I tried going this way. Okay, I'm on island one. I'm meant to be on two. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to like... You can't surf here? It's one of those like, clear-looking surfing spots I've ever seen, and you're not allowed there? Those are really bad items for this time of the game. Okay, maybe I actually do need a mon that has cut. Which, I mean, at this point, I don't even know who has cut. That's funny, I actually have a, another Tyrogue and Hitmonchan. Okay, let's see. You have Nasty Plot. Oh, Swanix has strength. Must be one of those things that learns it naturally in, in a game like this, because I think I literally just got strength as a, an HM. I must have talked cut to something at some point. There it is. That's right, I talked to my deck trio. It just chilled on the team with me leveling up for a while. Because I'm pretty sure it was a diglet whenever I first got it. Oh. I'm going to leave that alone right now. Maybe I can... Okay, I can't. Is this gonna help me? I literally just want to leave these islands so bad. Another one? Come on, is there nothing else? 
Like, I, I really want to look in these, don't get me wrong, guys, but, like, I just want to get off these islands more than anything. Because, like, I don't understand what's being solved. Okay, it's a dead end. This encounter raid out here is better than it is in the, um, Pokemon Mansion. It's just ridiculous there. Please tell me this isn't another legendary place. <sighs> like I already said, it's not that I don't want to mess with them, it's just... I want to leave the islands. I don't have the option to come here if I want to, which right now, I really don't want to come here at all. I already went that way. So it looks like the only point of that is getting to the red ice. Can I go down that way? Yes. Okay. There's no way the whole point of this little thing is just to heal us it. It is. Yep. basically what's three legendaries down there, but it's not really that helpful. I really don't want me just running around like an idiot to be this whole episode. Oh, thank you. Here we go. You had to go in the dumb game corner. Once this episode's done, I have to take a big old poo. Okay, I'm gonna take time and actually choose it. There we go. Now I bet I can move on, right? Yes, okay. I'm so, I'm so sorry, guys. Like, I, I know you're just screaming and yelling at me, being stupid. I just haven't really... I actually can't remember the last time I personally played through these islands. Ah, oh, dang it. I wanted to go get the Beldum. Okay. I feel like the fire should have protected me from your poison point. I have to face anyways. I don't want to be exploded on. Okay. Muck. It's fine. care of that first. Uh, I also gonna go ahead and say I probably won't mess with those ultra worm or hyper space holes because I just I just don't really care about them to be honest. Like what's a legendary really gonna do for me? Like I guess I have a master ball so like if one of them really looks good then I could um I could Is that Lestone? Oh, I'm not Lestone. Okay. <sighs> um. Yeah, there might be one legendary that's like just super good that might be worth getting. So like, I probably should at least check them. I think that'd be fair for me to at least take a look. So that'll probably be what I do 
Honestly, it's probably gonna be in the next episode because, like, um, because this is probably gonna take me the rest of this episode. Make my citrus berries. That's pretty. Only by 30 HP in this game. I see the love berries coming in handy though. I'm buy ten of those. You can buy PP ups too. I'm gonna buy 19 of these. Nice. I very much need to poop. Then I'm starting to do the squirm. I do not care about that cut tree. It'd be very strange if the actual games were like this one, where they hide stuff like the hyperspace holes in different spots, but um... At the same time, it would definitely encourage exploration even more than they do now. Because right now, it's just, it's kind of dull. Like, they don't really encourage you to really um, branch out and like look for new things. It's just kind of like, ooh, there might be some hidden items that you don't see very often kind of thing. Why did my energy ball do literally nothing to this thing? Them too. And I realized that I hope I actually remember to put it on the layout whenever I picked it back up after putting it back in. Because it probably won't appear on the layout until I, um, septile. Cool. Until the second time I pull it out after getting past the bike gang, because the first time I have it out for like 0.5 seconds. And an ivy sword. My doggo is sleeping, she's snoring. I don't know if you guys can hear it, but uh, she's adorable. Grab this meteorite. Just I'm assuming it's a meteorite. Okay, maybe it's like a Jirachi meteorite kind of thing. Weird how they have a cut tree inside the grass. I don't feel like we normally have that. Oh, I was assuming that was gonna be Listel. Uh Venus would have got this. I honestly just really enjoyed doing the Mega Evolution. Like it was actually really well implemented in this game as far as I can tell. Granted, I only have one Mega, but if I end up getting that Metagross, I might have two. I like Weasel. I remember when Weasel was in the anime. He was such a fun character. Because he was actually like a character, he wasn't just like a, a Pokemon. He had his own like character development throughout the whole series. Uh, in um, ba -ba -ba, Diamond and Pearl. Oh, there's uh, just more, more and more trainers, aren't there? Kind of thinking I was coming to the end of the road. Gold pen. I don't really want to get poisoned. There we go. Hey, I was right. The whole team is pretty basically balancing out to 80 right now. This is fairy fields. Yep. Looks like Kat would definitely speed up the process of getting through here. I could not imagine getting a level 35 Kakuna as an encounter and being happy about it. So not gonna worry about that item down there. Just gonna keep moving forward. Apparently I already have oh, I already had a B drill, that's right. That was a huge bang right above me. Sounds like someone like fell or they just like dropped something heavy. Which granted I have people moving in right above me, so either one is a possibility. Is there a Gengar here? Did the Gengar like scare her into Oh yeah I did.
Oh, please just let me out. Oh, let's go to the first island. It's fine. You know, I don't even know why I timestamp anymore. I end up looking through the episodes anyways, so there's no reason for me to actually do timestamping. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm home now. Thank you. Oh, so I'm getting a lot of emails from uh, my school about, um, you know, everything closing down and how pretty much everything's going online. And um, online schooling, I feel like, is actually a lot harder in, for me personally because um, my brain's dying. Because it yeah I, I literally am like dying over here oh because I have like better focus um, inside the classroom with that with the teacher like physically there as you can tell I have very few little focus now even sitting in front of games that like I am really aware of but um involved in like i'm on playing the game but like i feel like some some people who watch this might be even more involved than i am i'm just gonna make my way to viridian city at this point i'm on the road to viridian city i'm on the road i'm on the road what a good song did I even fight? Yeah, I think I did. Alright. So, I, I'm gonna go ahead and call it here for the episode. So if you enjoyed me just raging, fudging around, and just honestly being kind of an annoying person, um, let me know with a comment, a like. Um, if you enjoy what I'm doing, if you want to see more of me, just let me know. Like, I'd love to hear about six feedback, maybe some positive stuff. I can send that right back your way. You know, we we help. I help you. You help me. We scratch each other's back. Let's let's um let's have a laugh together. Let's just enjoy each other. That's what I'm feeling. I'll see you guys um, tomorrow on Wednesday's episode. So, bye guys.